All right, so I'm with my boy Joe, chugging the gallon. <laughs> Must be really, really nice. I'm still at 16 ounces. And that boy Kevin. And we're about to get tans. So uh, after this, there's really not much of doing anything. We can't sweat whatsoever. But Joe just told me I can't even walk with my backpack um, <laughs> on my shoulders afterwards. And yeah, so it's basically gonna be chilling the rest of the day, trying to stay cool. Um, can't even really go too hard on practicing posing because you know I just don't want to sweat. There will be a chance to get like backstage touch-ups right before we go on because I'm sure I'm gonna fuck up my tan somehow, some way in the middle of the night when I'm sleeping. Um, and to make that even worse, the bed sheets are white. So yeah, but uh, I'll show you guys when we get in here, hopefully about uh, how orange I'm about to look. All right, so they said they're gonna do face and hands tomorrow before we go on, so my face isn't really touched, but I mean, I'm so dark. Uh, pretty damn dark. I feel black, like black, black. <laughs> All right, guys, this is very, very important footage. Your boy finally got a refeed. We got two uh, Five Guys burgers, no cheese. We got bacon and then we got fries. And it's just, it's, it's beautiful. I'm so happy. I'm gonna smash this. I'm not even gonna talk too much. You guys know every time I get this refeed, I just wanna record the clip, document it, and eat. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna enjoy this and wake up fucking shredded tomorrow. We're less than 24 hours out. So tomorrow is the day, tomorrow's game day, tomorrow's day we've been preparing three months for. Enjoy this meal. And Wake up tomorrow locked in. Let's do it. What's going on guys? It is show day. So June 20th. Um, I, this is the first time I'm picking up the camera today. And honestly, today's just been kind of like a, a lot's been going on. We went to the morning show, supported the transformation clients. And other than that, we got some carb up food. I have two meals in me, uh, some oats from this morning and pop tart for the carbs. I uh, got a little bit of sodium through that too. And then I had 150 grams of rice. With that, we're cutting today's protein, ta protein take in half and then um, just carving up with rice until the show. Um, it's gonna be three total meals before we step on stage and then backstage pump up foods is looking like it's gonna be Rice Krispies and Reese's Cups. So uh, if anything, I'm excited to eat them. But uh, met Alex, he just was over at the Airbnb, you know, just kind of chopping it up. And we went over posing earlier at the actual venue. Um, nerves wise, guys, I can't say I'm nervous. That's not the word. It's like, I want, I'm, I want to be more confident in my posing. The way that I'm, kind of looking at it right now is I have practiced posing to the maximum capacity this entire time this entire prep so it's not coming from a lack of preparation at all it's it's just I'm being very honest with myself and realizing that my posing could have only gotten so good in this amount of time I have to work with what I have right now and I have to even if I'm not the most confident in it I have to go out there and present it with the most confidence because at this point it's not going to get any better for this show if that makes sense but all in all time's kind of crunching down to when we're going to go actually you know go to the venue be on stage start being around other competitors i'm getting more and more hype i'm literally so hyped that my boys are with me ty and cross i wouldn't want anyone else to be here with me uh cadence here but i mean i haven't got to see him much but I mean, it's show day. It's, it hasn't really it hasn't really hit me yet. Like it's gonna hit me when I get there, and um, I'm not worried about the competition. I'm just gonna go out there and know that I fucking murdered the physique that I brought two years ago. Murdered that shit. That's not even the same competitor. And I'm gonna go out there and do my best. And you know, you hear the cliche shit all the time. Oh, you know, just make sure you have fun. But like, I'm gonna make sure I enjoy this moment because I prepared for 14 fucking weeks for it and put myself through some miserable, some miserable times. So uh, I'm excited. 
Um, I'm so excited to see my mom. She's she's coming down. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see her. And yeah, so I will see you guys at the venue when um, closer to showtime. guys it's that time we on the way we on the way so the show starts at 6 30. um yeah. classic is a before physique um and the crazy the crazy thing is there's one person in bodybuilding Damn. and they automatically basically just win the overall win the alpha Lee sponsorship and uh that's pretty crazy i don't know like how i'd feel about that i mean it's dope to get the sponsorship but like you literally didn't compete with nobody. But uh, yeah, Classic goes before, so I want to definitely get there a little bit early to watch that. About to meet up with my mom. Um, and then it's stage time. I got the Rice Krispies on deck. I got the Reese's. And uh, I mean, yeah, that's about it. Oh my God. This nigga went full black on me. That's crazy. Oh, Ooh, the damn crazy. Hey bro, you better stop my acting. Okay. Oh my God. Are you about to meet my mom? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. How that crazy is that? I'm literally about to move across states with this new guy. And there go my mom up there. I miss her so fucking much. Dude. I really do. I've seen her. It's been like two weeks since I've seen her, but I miss her so much. And I'm so fucking happy that she's here. Oh yeah, I saw you. And him. And him. And him. And him. And him. Dude behind the camera. Hey, here, can join me on? Hey, you got the tickets? Yeah. yeah. Alright, guys. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. I haven't met I haven't, I haven't met Caden. Hey, how are you doing? Good, how are you? It's funny running into you here. Hi, I'm Hi, Devin. Nice to meet you, I'm Caden. Nice, nice to meet you. You have tickets for us or no? Yeah. Are you excited, bro? Uh, white envelope. And I swear I bought, remember us having that conversation about front row tickets and camera? Yeah, you probably did, but it's like, it's like general. everyone's just, everyone's okay. just. But, is there, but if you have front row tickets, tell somebody to get up. Oh right? yeah, if you have the seat, you yeah. No, this one, I, I need to eat this meal. So my, listen to this, my class, bro, I'm with like, I'm with people who are like 5'9", and some people who are like 6 foot. Like, no, I'm, no, I'm with but people who six are 5'9". Six foot is jump from like, you, though. Huh? Because you're like 5'11". Yeah, bro, but they're like people who are, they're just... Wide they, variety. They just made stuff up, yeah. yeah. I think it's because they wanted to make the classes, like... Well, the classes are so uneven, is what I heard, like... They are. There's well, like, like some, hundreds and one, and like...
Alright guys, I'm gonna be completely straight up. I don't forgot to pick up the camera after all of this. I've just been back here just, as soon as I stepped off stage, just like energy, just talking to people. So it was basically my boy, bro, remind me of your name, I'm Bennett, sorry. Bennett. Bennett. Yeah. Me, Bennett, uh, Earl, the Yo. fucking monster. Appreciate monster. It. Appreciate it. Like nah, just ungodly. Right and uh, I think Brady Oak, I think we're gonna basically be fighting for top four. Um, I think definitely my man Earl got it. Like that's not really a question. That they moved me center stage first, which blew my mind because I was just kind of convinced Earl had it. So I was there for probably the shortest amount of time, put Earl there, and then uh, I was next to him for a minute, and then my boy Bennett came over, took it. So it could really, between, or Earl got it, but between us three, I think it's damn near up in the air. Um, but regardless, dude, that was like, I'm trying to think of the word to describe that. That was worth every week of dieting. And that was just worth every week of dieting. My, I was, my body physically hurts. I was up there just like tense, tight, 
and like my heart was my heart was the, was the thing like it was so tight like I felt like it was it wasn't beating hard it my chest just felt so tight and I think that was like the longest comparison they had it was I heard 11 minutes did yeah, they say bro, something we, like we 11 minutes a, cool a long time the longest time and the longest bro Christian and all the other judges were just like eyeballing us like literally make just make an eye contact with us and I could tell they were having a tough time making a decision but regardless dude that was worth every week of dieting we're gonna go out there and see what we end up placing <sighs> regardless man we me and Bennett bro we 2019 two years ago we were standing next to each other on stage and uh, I'll see if I'll, I'll probably throw a picture up but um we ended up standing right next to each other on stage again this year both with like at least eight more pounds of muscle oh, on our face we both like look way yeah almost, damn near, bro, yeah. a lot more um but bro that experience that experience is just like bro the vibes around this whole weekend like this shit is this i love this shit either way i'm gonna I'm keep i'm gonna just i'm gonna keep living in the moment man i'll see you guys when uh we get a determination of class d uh placements in no particular order are you get number 206 All right, I wasn't really planning on picking the camera back up until we got back to Indy, but this is very important footage. Yeah, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I just wanted to show y'all that. All right, so I'm damn near not even right. So I, you know, I've been talking about Chick-fil-A and how I need it. Well, I got it, and then, so right after getting it, I was scrolling through Snap, seeing the Crows and Tide was at Whataburger. Now, you can't do that to me. So, in the past, not, not even 24 hours, in the past, like, 12 or 14 hours, I've had Whataburger, Raising Cane's, In-N-Out, and now Chick-fil-A. Before they do that, but that's insane. I've knocked two of those things the first time. I've only had this once. Hey, but we earned it. We earned this shit. So, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go ham on this. I never show me eating because I get the food and I'm just like too, like, ready to eat it. But, uh, yeah. I think that's gonna wrap up this video, guys. If you're still here at this point in the video, appreciate you watching. Go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe button if you're new. Notification bell. Don't miss any videos. I will see you guys in the next one.